Stephen Hawking, who spent 55 years of his life bound to a wheelchair, was neither able to eat, and used to speak with the help of a computer. Stephen Hawking is not among us anymore, but before his death, he made some terrible predictions about Earth's destruction, which we are going to discuss in this video. At the age of 21, Stephen Hawking was diagnosed with a rare condition that generally occurs in people over the age of 50, and it is quite deadly. Doctors shared the life-shattering news with Stephen Hawking that he had only two years to live. A person to whom life had given a two-year ultimatum, he proved doctors wrong by living 55 years with this condition. He didn't let his condition get the better of him, rather, he wanted to make his condition his strength. Because of this condition, he was bound to a wheelchair and was unable to eat or even speak. He was fed through a tube and breathed through another tube. And for speaking, a special computer was attached to his wheelchair, and through a small muscle in his jaw, he used to type on the computer, which the computer converts into speech and conveys his feelings to others. Almost all of his body parts stopped working, but he had one thing that was far stronger than any ordinary human being. Stephen Hawking had an extraordinary brain that had a far greater capacity to think and analyze than a normal human being. He published eight books while sitting in a wheelchair, he unveiled such facts about the universe that shook the world, which includes black holes. On the one hand, his theories amazed researchers and scientists, on the other hand, there are a lot of predictions by Stephen Hawking that have made people apprehensive and fearful. In these terrible predictions, Stephen Hawking predicted how and when our planet Earth and its inhabitants would get decimated. Let us see what these five predictions are. Number 5. While bound to a wheelchair for 55 years, Stephen Hawking did a lot of research about the universe and concluded that life is also present beyond Earth and someday aliens will capture our planet. Let me tell you here that, according to scientific theory, our universe was created as a result of the Big Bang. But Hawking's theory was a little different. He believed that multiple Big Bangs happened, and that every Big Bang created a different universe. That means Stephen Hawking believed in a parallel universe. Although there is no proof of the existence of another universe, but Stephen Hawking strongly believed that, someday aliens would visit Earth to study us, and gradually capture it. Number 4. Just two weeks before his death in 2018, Stephen Hawking published his final research paper to prove his theory of multiple universes which was called, a smooth exit from eternal inflation. Hawking postulated that, even though our universe was created due to a Big Bang, and it is still expanding, and a time will come when it will fall short of the energy to expand further. At that time, all the stars will gradually die, and eternal darkness will settle across the universe. He believed that this would be the time when our universe would come to an end. Hawking strongly wanted humans to search for, and settle on a planet inside a parallel universe to protect our own species. Number 3. Despite Stephen Hawking's needing the aid of a robotic wheelchair, but he was very much against these robots. Although robots are built to make our work easier, but they are becoming more advanced day by day. At present, there are many robots that perform such tasks through artificial intelligence, which seems impossible for us. Stephen Hawking predicted that, one day robots would become so powerful that they would build another robot themselves. As we know the intelligence of robots can be enhanced to a level with which humans cannot compete, an example of such a robot can be found in Israel's Iron Dome, which is a highly intelligent air defense system. This Iron Dome can neutralize dozens of incoming missiles at once in the sky. Not only that, in just one mini second, the robot inside it first destroys those missiles that are going to fall in the populated area. Stephen Hawking predicted that one day robots will be so powerful that they will try to control humans, and they will eventually succeed. Number 2. We all know that violence is in the very nature of human beings, and doesn't seem to end, which we can see that in the recent Russia-Ukraine war. To support their fights, humans have developed weapons that can wipe out entire humanity in one go. These are also called weapons of mass destruction. In World War II, America dropped two atomic bombs on the two Japanese cities of Hiroshima and Nagasaki. The consequences are still evident even today. Stephen Hawking had predicted that, if humans don't learn to live peacefully together, one day they will fight with each other and start a nuclear war, which will be the last day of this world. And now number one. The most terrible predictions of Stephen Hawking is global warming. Stephen Hawking believed that, even if humanity escapes unscathed from every calamity, in the coming 600 years, this place will become impossible for humans to live in. At that time, there will be no forest left, the seas will get dry, and there will be no signs of humans. 
The most prominent reason will be the increasing population, and another reason would be the use of excess fossil fuel. Hawking believed that in next 600 years, Earth's condition would be like that of Venus. The average temperature of Earth will rise up to 250 degrees Celsius, and there will be rains of sulfuric acid instead of water, and hot winds will reach speeds up to 360 km per hour. The way Stephen Hawking turned a doctor's two-year ultimatum into 55 years. Similarly we can also increase the life of our planet by planting some trees in our locality. We are sure that you will like this video, so do not forget to like the video, and subscribe to the channel, we will meet you soon with another new video.